Hello there, adventurers, and welcome to Wally DM. Today's video is part of an entire D&D YouTuber chain. There are a lot of us YouTubers that are asking each other questions, and we're forming a video response. So this is my response to D&D YouTuber Nick Pearson. And Nick asked this question here. Hey Wally, what is something you wish D&D would change back to the way it used to be in previous editions? Or a mechanic or something that they dropped from previous editions that you would like to see brought back in the future? So that is a great question and absolutely I know what I would bring back and it's going to be from one of the older editions. This ascending armor class where you roll in today's D&D and add your modifiers to see what armor class you hit, this experiment's going on way too long. Everybody knows that the descending armor classes of first and second edition were much better. If you had a minus two armor class, you were badass and hard to hit. Now let's take that one step further and bring back the hit roll charts and that mathematical equation that we all loved, and that was Thacko. Thacko, two hit armor class zero, second edition. So what am I getting at? It's too simple. Combat is too easy. You roll a number and then you just add to it, and then whatever the armor class is, you go from there. That's not even a challenge. Let's get back to to hit armor class zero. Thacko makes things complicated. It makes it more challenging. You've got to do all this math and uh, what's that? Thacko sucks. What? You're kidding me, right? I, I was going to do the entire video on this. Never mind. Okay. Truth be told, my friends, there's really nothing that I enjoyed so much from any of the previous editions that I would bring back to 5e. I absolutely love 5th edition, and everything that I enjoyed about previous editions are there. And I think that was the purpose of them introducing 5th edition to us, is to bring everything that we liked into one system. Now, there's a few things that are options or variants that you can find in the DMG to change the game to make it more like some of the previous editions, and those should be covered with your players in a session zero and if there's something that is missing just homebrew it in. Now with that being said I really didn't answer the question but there are some things that I would improve or like to see more of and that is poison, curses, disease, ability score damage, and ability score drain. I think they're all underrepresented. So that was fun. Hopefully you're not too mad at me for not answering the question directly. I really do believe that 5th edition has everything that I need. But for those of you that are watching, be sure to leave a comment below. Let us know what you would bring back from an older edition into 5e. So let's keep this D&D YouTuber chain going. The next question is going to be for Luna from the Lubuffin YouTube channel. And Luna, I'm going to ask you, what Disney villain would you put in your campaign as the BBEG, the big bad evil guy? I'm looking forward to your response on this. This should be a lot of fun. For those of you that are watching my channel now, be sure to click the link in the description below to go over to Luna's channel or follow it here at the end of the video. Thank you very much for watching and on to the next.